With the latest from News for Jack, I'm Joy Purdy. A deadly shooting Wednesday afternoon near the Newtown area is believed to be connected to a double shooting Tuesday night in the same area. The sheriff's office says it got a shot spotter alert about 12.50 p.m. Wednesday from multiple gunshots at West 5th and Whitner Streets, followed by several 911 calls. When police arrived, according to the sheriff's office, they found a man in his 30s dead in the road of at least one gunshot wound. 18 months after 17 people were killed in that mass shooting at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, lawmakers are introducing a bill to crack down on the sale of gun ammunition. Jamie's Law takes its name from 14-year-old Jamie Gutenberg, one of the victims of the February 14, 2018 massacre. Her father has been pushing for legislation that would require background checks on all ammunition sales. And first responders from three agencies and an off-duty police officer on vacation all took part in a dramatic rescue in St. Johns County, saving a father and son caught in a rip current. 14-year-old Ethan Martin and his father Andrew were vacationing from Illinois in St. Augustine Beach. Martin is a corrections officer for an Illinois state prison. The two said they were body surfing Tuesday afternoon when they were knocked over by waves and swept out by a rip current. The two can swim but said the conditions were just too rough for them to get back to shore. You can always find the latest news on newsforjax.com. Have a great night.